so recently I went through my dad's drawer and I realized I found an old little old little iPod right here. And this is a black iPod. This is a fifth generation. This is not like a music or nano. This is the original iPod fifth generation. It was it was in a drawer for a really long time. And this is a 30 gigabyte model. I even looked up the model number. It's A1136, which is a fifth generation iPod. I'm pretty sure the battery's dead on it. And it's been dead for years. So I'm going to go charge it and see if it will turn on. I have my connected brick and all my 30 pan connected. So let's see if we get some power in this bad boy. There we go. It's plugged in. Oh, we have the Apple logo. There's like a little Apple logo. If you can't see that, well, that's the Apple logo. So maybe we might got some life to this. I think it died. Oh, never mind. It, don't tell me it's boot looping. I think it... Oh, this is not good, guys. Oh, it's making clicking noise as well. If you hear that clicking noise, this is an issue. This is boot looping. Like, listen, look closely, listen closely. Yeah, if you heard that click, it's boot looping. So I'm not sure if it's, if the boot loop is cause of a very dead battery or something, or I may have to reset this through iTunes. If it's not, if it's not that, then it might be through the battery. So what I'm going to do is now is I'm going to let this charge for a little while and I'll be back and see if we get some life. All right, guys, I got an update and it says, v please wait, very low battery. So what what happened was when I plugged it in, it was boot looping. So that had to be do with a very dead battery. Now we have a loading pinwheel circle. It says, please wait. So basically what happened was this device hasn't been used in a really long time. So when it was in a drawer, the battery was very dead because it hasn't been used in a while. Because that this thing was in a drawer for a really long time. I actually have a box to this. While I wait for that to wait, um, I actually have a box like this. So here's the, I actually found the original box to this in the basement. So basically... This is a iPod 5th generation. So I have its original box. This is the back of it. This is what it looks like on the back. So I'm in plays music videos and photo slideshows up to 14 hours of music playback and with rechargeable lithium battery. So it's a black one. Designed by Apple in California, symbol in China. A1113. And this is a A1136. So that's basically the, the one we we're looking for. What year did this came out? Uh, we did it show on the back, I think. I think I forget when this thing came out. Oh, we have the Apple logo. And no, it went back to the please wait very low battery. So it's going to continue doing that once it has a charge. And what does it say? And if you want to download music or whatever, you have it requires a Mac or PC with USB port 2.0. Mac OS 10 version 10.3.9 or later. Windows 2000 Service Pack 4 or Windows XP Home or Professional. I will tr I actually don't have a 2000 Windows 2000 or XP computer. What I might try to see. I actually have a bit of a newer computer, so I'm going to try my Windows 11 PC. I have iTunes on it already, and see if it will still detect. I know this is old. I'm just trying to see where the model, the, the year that came out. And if you don't think it says on the box, unfortunately. Well, the top says 30 gigabytes, 7,500 songs. So... If I find the model, guys, I'll be back, and I'll be back when this thing boots up and gets battery charge on it, and I'll be back. All right, guys, so I had looked up the um, the year when this device came out, and this device came out in 2006. 
it was one year before the original iPhone came out, which is, man, this is older than the original iPhone. If you can't see that well on the screen, it still says, please wait, very low battery. It, I don't know why the screen's dimmed. I think that's when my mom or my father turned down the brightness. And when I was looking for it, it actually showed the Apple logo again, but it went back to the very low battery. So this is going to be doing that loop for a little while until we get some charge on this bad boy. Yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys had an iPod, if something that looks like this. Let me know in the comments what was your, what was your first iPod and what model was it? While well, I will wait for it to show, I will show you the, um, the, the, this is the screen. This is your play and pause. Uh, I think that was the the previous song or the next song. This is the home the button. I think that's for the pinwheel as well. And menu. There's our lightning port. We actually have a connector to a lightning connector. Uh, not lightning port. A 30 pin port. Sorry. This take 30 pin before lightning came out. Lightning didn't exist until iPhone 5. They have this switch. The headphone jack. Whatever that says. It says hold. You probably won't see it, but. We got the Apple logo, so I think we might have some charge. Nope, went back to low battery. Okay, never mind. So if you can't see that well, guys, that actually says hold. Whatever that does, I'll have to look at it when it boots up. Anyways, I'm going to go get my first one. I'll be getting, um, so this is not the first iPod I had in my collection. I'll go show you guys my first iPod I had in my collection. So basically, this was my first iPod that I was given before I got the 6th gen. So this is an iPod Touch 2nd gen, which is a 832 gigabyte. This was my first iPod in my collection. So basically, that was when they had the touch screen then before they removed the um, the old style pinwheel and all that. It takes the same connector, has headphone jack, has sound speakers on it. No camera. The camera didn't come out until the iPod touch fourth gen basically i actually had it charged in it the battery died on it again i will have to show you that later but anyways while we get some charge on this bad boy like i just said i'll be back and once this thing boots up all right so um, it still says please wait very low battery and when that apple logo just came back it made a little bit of a clicking noise but not as loud anymore like it did a little bit so Who I miss the good old days. I it's a shame that Apple discontinued the iPod, which is sad. I tested all the but I actually tested all the buttons. It's everything works. I have to try headphones. This did not take Bluetooth. I think it has Bluetooth. I'm not sure. So that's that's actually the FC FC labels and all that. Oh, well, that's weird because it says. 2005 Apple Computer Incorporation, which is weird because when I looked up the model, it said 2006, and that one says 2005. So it may, it might have came out in 2005. So I'll just call it that. So maybe I think it was a little bit of a mistake because I thought on Google, according to Google, it said um, it came out in 2006. So this is way older than the iPhone because the iPhone did not came out until 2007. Because I gotta fix that connector. It, I, it's bothering me. So I like how the battery icon says that it has a no symbol with the battery. Because normally on newer devices today, like the i newer iPhones and iPads and the iPod touches before they got discontinued, when the batteries are low, it, when you turn it, try to turn it on, Normally, um, it will show like a little image of a battery and a little bit of a red um, line, it, like blinks a little bit, like maybe t three or two times, and it would go off. Sometimes when you plug it in, it will show the battery light again, but with the red thing still there, or whatever it's called. Okay, so when I was talking, I did saw a little bit of the screen dis disappeared and came back, so it may have life now, I'm not sure. So basically, um, back before, way before jailbreak happened, um, 
there was not a way you can jailbreak these. I think the only time you can jailbreak these is um, the, were the newer touchscreens because. I, so if you haven't heard of City, it's a jailbreak app for iOS devices. Cydia has been around for a really long time. They're normally, I've seen a few old, older videos of some people jailbreaking their iPhones and making tutorials. But most of the tutorials I saw were from years ago, and I don't think they are around on YouTube anymore. But however, Cydia still exists. But th back when this came out, Cydia did not came out because the creator of Cydia was named Jay. I'm not sure if Jay is still a part of Cydia. I'm not sure. I know because it says welcome when you first launched City, I would say welcome to City by some guy named Jay or whatever. You know what I'm talking about. So yes, guys, I'm gonna let you guys know. I am not gonna be jailbreaking my current devices. I'll be only jailbreaking my older devices. So do not tell do not tell me in the comments jailbreak my current device. That's stupid. Oh, update. We got the Apple logo, a little bit brighter now. That's good. So that's the Apple logo right there. So we have some charge on this thing now. Oh, it disappears for a second. Oh, God, we almost had it. It went back to dark, and it says, please wait, very low battery. So, and it did that thing again. Man, we almost had it, guys. This baby almost had it, came to life. Alright, so I'm going to stop talking for a while, and I'll be back once we do get some charge. Please have some power. Tell me you're alive. Come on, baby. Hope you're alive. Don't you die on me. Alright, I got some updates. So, the it's doing the boot loop thing again, but earlier it just did the, um, when the bright apple came on, it went off for a second and came back and did it again then now it's back on this so i am not sure when it's gonna be gonna get in charge so this is gonna take a while so i'll be back if we get any updates all right so it's doing this again so earlier it did this hold on it's gonna do it see there's the bright apple logo Then any second now, it's going to die again. Oh, it went back to... Yeah, that's what it did. So then it's going to probably going to go back to the... um. Yep. That's what I was trying to explain to you guys. So it, this is going to take a really long time. Alright, so we'll have to wait and find out. So if you guys don't know what I'm talking about when, earlier, like it's I'll explain to you guys. So right now it's saying, please wait. Very low battery. So that means that the, it's still dead. And we have the pinwheel that it's going to try to do a retry of the about. So the pinwheel is meaning that spinning. It's because it's trying to restart and see if it will get any battery life or something. I also have to clean the screen. I'm going to be cleaning the whole device once we get some power and get it fully charged. So this is what I'm talking about. So... When the Apple logo came on, like any sec now, it's going to go, the screen's going to go a little bit bright. There it is. Then any second now, it's going to die again, and it's going to dim the screen. Like, watch. Any second now. Yep, that's what I was talking about. Then it's. Then it goes, it is, it is going to do it again, like, watch. Then it went back to the Dark Apple logo. Then now it's doing that. Now it came back to Bright. Then it's going to do the same thing again, like, watch. Yep, there it is. Then it's going to do it the third time, I think. Yep. It, and you know what's going to happen. It's going to die. Watch. Any second now. Yep. You can still hear clicks from the device. Then it's going to go back to the very low battery screen thing. Yep, there it is. So that's what I was trying to talk to you about. So we'll wait until we get power. Like I just said a billion times, we'll wait. Update, guys. So we I just saw the home screen for a second. Then went back to the Apple logo when I just started recording. 
So, when I was off camera, I saw the home screen that I tried to get my camera out as fast. And, you know, I saw the home screen, then they went back to the Apple logo when I just started recording. So, this means that the battery is not bad. So, it's not dead or, it's not, so what I'm trying to say is the battery is not in horrible condition. It still has life into it. Because if there was a bad battery, it would not boot up the device. And yep, it's going to do the please wait, very low battery. So, man, if I see the home screen thing again, I'll be back. All right, so there's the Apple logo thing again. So, let's see if it'll go to the home screen like it did last time. If it doesn't, if it just dies, then I'll just wait. I guess I'll watch YouTube videos and wait. Yep, there it is. That's the home screen. That's the home screen right there. So it has photos, videos, and all that. So basically, the battery is alive. I'm just nervous it's going to die again. Yep, there it is. It's dead again. So, But yes, guys, that was the home screen. So you saw the home screen. I wasn't going to use the touch of the thing already, but I know the battery is very dead right now. So, yes, guys. So, what I'm going to do now is, since it's all still alive, I'll be back in probably in, a, in an hour or maybe a two hour. I'm not sure. And see we get some charge on this thing. And I actually found out that the switch, the little, the little switch thing up here, that's actually the one that says hold. That's just the on and off switch. So, yeah, let's wait. Update. So, there was a little message that was on this home screen. Saying that there was like no battery power remaining or something. I think it was showing a sec. It says no battery connected for a second. Hold up. It's, is it going to do it? It did it while I was off camera. Oh, it's going to die, isn't it? And let me guess. It's going to die? Hmm, I think it has battery now. It hasn't died yet. Alright, so the the thing is alive. Alright. There's the pinwheel. Alright, let's see. I'm not used to the pinwheel. Let's see, settings. About... Oh, that's my mom's name. I gotta blur that out. One oh six in the morning. She had three hundred ninety one songs. Version one point three. How do I go back? Oh, there I gotta go menu. All right, let's see. Let's see any photos. Oh, that was that was the pictures of me when I was so when I was a baby. Okay, I'm gonna blur that out. I don't want anyone to see that. But yes, guys. Oh, now it says no battery power remains. Please connect iPod to power. All right. Yeah, it's gonna die. Oh. But yes, guys. Just want to say that we did saw some stuff on here. I'm not really going to be showing you guys the music, so. But yes, guys, that's going to be pretty much it of this um, fifth generation iPod right here that I found. And here is the original box again right here. If you guys enjoyed this video, let me know. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye, everybody.